Good afternoon, I'm Lauren McCoy. And I'm Meg Gatto. We begin with breaking news from the St. Rock neighborhood. Neighbors say a man hit and killed a woman with a car. And the driver is now in custody. Chris Welty is live near the scene at St. Rock and Murray Street. Those who heard the commotion are in disbelief. They say they are shocked that this happened. Surveillance video shows a silver SUV driving down Murray near St. Rock. A woman gets out of the vehicle and then the SUV creeps up. Eventually, the SUV appears to accelerate out of frame. He just drove over her right through there. This woman who lives above the crash initially thought someone was robbing the unit below her. She called 911. She says her cameras captured what she believes was an argument before the woman was run over and pushed through the building. And I saw the guy very clearly. He didn't leave. He was running around and they got him easy. NOPD says the woman died on scene and they were able to take the driver into custody. A man from the bar across the street describes a noise he heard as a box truck hitting a pothole. He says he saw the driver get out and look at the body. He was frantic trying to get in and out and the car was kind of he couldn't really open the doors to the car because it was wedged in there. For much of the lunch rush, crime scene tape roped off several blocks, something that caught Robert Feller's attention. It was a movie set at first and then I saw the, the corner van and it's like, oh no, something's happened. As for those who live in the area, they acknowledge the magnitude a split second choice can have. Very sad. You don't know what's going to happen when you wake up in the morning. Police have not released the suspect's name. The owner is already making repairs. As you can see, the window where that car drove through is already boarded up. We're told that space was recently leased, so they're hoping to make those repairs as quickly as possible. Reporting in St. Rock, Chris Welty, Fox 8, Local First.